Zaymel, Meeting the Kids, Season 2, Episode 1. Baby's crying. <sighs> Look, little ones, it's okay. Shh. You are who you are, who you are. Pretty just a pretty one. F. Mel sang. So beautiful, Zayn said, leaning on the wall, wide awake. Zane, you were up this whole time? Halfmel said. Maybe. Why you ask? Zane wondered. Cause you left them crying, Halfmel said. Ugh, no I didn't. They were crying when I went downstairs to get some coffee. Zane answered. Really? Halfmel wondered. Yeah, so now that you're up, we have some left of a pizza. And yes, I know it's my turn to feed the kids, Zane said. <laughs> hey, wait. How did you sleep so well? Half now asked. I'm a happy sleeper, Zane answered. Okay. Well, you have the pizza. You bring the kids, Half now said. And she went downstairs. Before she went to the kitchen, the doorbell rang. Come in. She walked. To the door, yes, half mouth said. So, what did it just look like? Not we came to ask her how she is, Dante said. Dante, stop playing around. We came here for the babies. Also, did you know that my brother's a heavy sleeper? God said, Uh, first of all, yes. I know. Second, Zane is feeding them, and crash! Uh, honey, you okay? Afma asked. Ugh, Zane gone. These kids are monsters, Zane said painfully. Oh, how could you say that? God walked inside. They could be angels, God said as he made his way to the kitchen. <gasps> they are angels! God shouted. So you're not going to help me up, Zane said. Oh, sorry, little brother, God said. As he helped his brother up. Thanks, I guess. Zane said. So, what's their names? God asked. Luna is the one with the dark hair, the troublemaker, Zane answered. Before Zane could finish, before get Zane could go on, Afmel walks in. Zane, you hurt. What happened, Afmel's axe? Look, it was Luna. I think she has my Shadow Knight jeans. <gasps> what if they all have our other foam jeans? Cause you said you got turned into a cat, so what if Zane got cut off? No, 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 they can't. They couldn't. It's impossible. Afma answered. Nope, nothing's ever impossible. Isn't that right, Luna? God said. But then, they don't know how to control it. Then the whole world will ding dong. The Dobo wings. Oh, get it. Girls, I'm so glad to see you. Afma hugs Caitlin and Kawaii Jen. Oh, Afma Senpai, it's so great to see you. It's been too long for Kawaii Jen. And came in summer, so we will have a girl night out. Kawaii Chan will. If the girls are going out, Kawaii Chan, well, if the girls are going out, I would love to join. Travis said. Travis! God, Lawrence, Zane, and Dante shouted. Zane. Zane, how about we go on a guy's night out, Zane said. I mean, how about we go on a guy's night out, Zane said. But honey, who's going to watch the kids? Afma wondered. Uh, Zoe? She love kids? Zane answered. Yeah, but she lives far away. And Afma got cut off by the one and only super Amazingly awesome and cool. Just do it. <sighs> Fine. 
Foxerita. So you mean you have no one at all? Always around the corner, listening to everything you're saying, and still not notice me. I've been here when they woke up, and we cut pizza. Then Afma woke up, cause of Luna, but never men mentioned me at all. So I'll just take care of the kids, Foxy the said. I, um, okay, if you say so, Rita. Afma responded. Sorry for the very, very, very long wait. I was thinking of what else to... What else to write. And... I thought of that. So, yeah. Later on, I'll post another video. Maybe tomorrow. Because I have some information to tell you guys. I'm Foxy to Love. And... Peace... Out!